three patients, three complicated lives. Each one of them has decided to put their treatment into the hands of one surgeon. In 2010, Yi Shouling was the victim of a hostage crisis. She was shot in the mouth and has been attempting reconstructive surgeries ever since. This is Using the 3D model, the team has constructed a titanium frame that will fix the angle and position of the transplanted fibula bone in place. In the final stage of transplanting her fibula to her jaw, Dr. Wei realizes there is so much scarring, it is impossible to find viable blood vessels to complete circulation. After double and triple checking her angiogram, the team is able to attach the fibula and the skin flap using the artery under Yi Xiaoling's tongue. Dr. Wei's microsurgeries have forced him to master the human body from head to toe, or today, from toe to hand. A gruesome accident at work left Lin Jiajian without most of his right hand. After weeks of deliberation, he finally decided to proceed with a painful transplant. The intricacy of his operations means that his surgeries need to remain as blood-free as possible. Jia Jian has successfully completed his surgery, but Lin Ya Ling has a long road ahead. Lin Ya Ling's salivary gland cancer was treated with particle radiation therapy, saving her life but destroying her lower left jaw. The skin flap and fibula bone are removed together, thus retaining their blood supply and remaining living tissue. They're cut into the precise length necessary to rebuild Lin Yaoling's jaw. After well over 10 hours of surgery, Yaoling is moved to the ICU for monitoring. For the patients in physical rehab, slowly but surely, things are changing. Professor Hu Wei, his accomplishments are now world-renowned. He is one of the pioneers in microsurgery. He walks into a room in a con in an international conference and he's mobbed like Lady Gaga. Uh, he is truly amazing. Dr. Wei has helped them face the rest of their lives with strength and dignity. Heading one of the top teams in the world, Dr. Wei Fuchuan has made Taiwan a leader in the field of reconstructive plastic surgery.